Alright, hello everyone, and in this video, we're going to be talking about navigating. How do we move around in Maya? So now that we know what Maya is used for, we have to figure out, okay, how do we move around in here? Um, moving around is one of those very basic, essential things that we're going to be doing practically all the time. So, to, to get things started, I highly stress getting a three-button mouse because it's going to make moving around the easiest that it possibly can be. Without a three-button mouse, <clears throat> um, it's actually going to be very difficult to do some basic movements. All right, um, and Maya can already be difficult as it is in its own light. So, get a three-button mouse. All right. Um, <laughs> so to start off, <clears throat> if you're on a PC, you're going to want to hold down the Alt button. Um, if you're on a Mac, you hold down the Apple button, which looks like what's shown on the screen right now. And if you left-click while still holding down the button then you'll be able to rotate around the pivot. By default, our pivot is at the origin space, right where this grid, these two main grid lines meet. That's our origin. <coughs> so by default, um, we're able to rotate around that by left clicking and holding down Alt or the Apple key if you're on a Mac. All right, now if you right click, still holding down Alt, you can zoom in and out. And if you middle mouse click, then you're able to pan. Now, if you're on a laptop um, and it's a PC, you have two mouse buttons beneath your your um, touchpad. <clears throat> you may be able to hold down both mouse buttons together while holding down Alt, and that might be the equivalent to a middle mouse click. However, some laptops may work, some may not. So. Getting a three button mouse is just going to make things a lot easier. You'd be surprised just how simple this small movement, panning from side to side or up and down, can really be um, in trying to see what you're trying to look at. All right? So, those are the three basic movements in Maya. With those three movements, you can get your camera anywhere that you want. Um, another helpful thing in moving around is this view cube. It's in the top left hand corner of your window. Um, it's, letting, it's letting you know where the front is, where the top is. Um, you can click on these sides. The camera jumps to a preset um, camera angle. You can go from the corner, the front corner, um, and when you're ready, you can just click home to go back to its default position. Now, if you can't see a view cube, to turn it on, just go up to the display menu at the top of the screen. Go down to heads up display. And close to the bottom, you'll see View Cube. Just make sure that it's checked. All right. <clears throat> so that's basically how you move around in Maya. Just make sure that you get a three-button mouse. All right. So in the next video, we're going to be look looking into how to create objects. What are different types of objects?